Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a short tutorial on how I create nose to ear chains. Um, now most nose to ear chains I make and sell on my Etsy aren't like the ones I am wearing. Um, they are nose to ear chains that go from the nose or from the lip or whatever you want to attach it to and go to your ear. So they have like an earring attachment. You can hook them in your ear. Uh, mine is actually made a bit longer so I can just hook it over my ear to wear it. It is how I like to wear my nose ear chains most. Um, if someday you want to order from me um, from my Etsy store and you want one that hooks over your ear as well, um, just leave me a note and let me know. I can make those no problem. Um, as you can see, I've attached mine to the hoop on my nose right now. Um, I also attached mine to my septum piercing, so I make sure that I can um, attach it to the tiny balls of um, my septum hoop. You can, of course, also attach these to lip rings or to other piercing jewelry you might have. Um, yeah, and without further ado, let's get started. So for the most basic nose to ear chain, which is a plain chain one, you will need jewelry tools. So round nose pliers, flat nose pliers and a side cutter. Then you will need a chain, of course. Jump rings, I have an assortment, but we will be using four and five millimeter ones mainly. You will also need some earring hooks and finally tiny lobster clasps. So the first step is taking the chain and actually cutting the piece you want to use for your nose to ear chain. My measurement is about 14 centimeters and this is the length I mainly use. So I just cut a little less since we will still be attaching the earring and the clasp to it. Um, but you can choose whatever length you want, that's totally up to you and cut it with your side cutters. Then we are gonna take the jump rings, these are 4mm ones, the tiny lobster clasp and the earring hook and we're gonna attach these to the chain. So take your round nose pliers and your flat nose pliers and bend um, the jump ring open, attach it to the chain and then attach um, on one side the earring hook and on the other side the tiny lobster clasp. Um, if you want to make a longer one you can hang over your ear, you don't have to attach an earring hook, um, you can do as you please. And then you are either done or you can add a second layer of chain or you can add a jewelry finding to it, so a cross, a bed, um, anything you like really. So the way to do this is again take a jump ring, take the finding, open up the jump ring, attach it to the chain, attach the finding and then close the jump ring again. This is really simple and this is how I create most of my nose to ear chains that are made out of chain. For the second type, which was the one I was wearing in this video, you will need beads, eye pens, um, again the same jewelry tools we had earlier, jump rings, earring hooks and tiny lobster clasps. So for this one I'm using 4mm black round glass beads and then the eye pins, these are a 22mm, so I am still cutting off a tiny bit at the end of every eye pin um, just to make the loop a bit smaller. So you can see me using my side cutters here to cut off a tiny bit and then using the flat nose pliers to hold the pin and the round nose pliers to create the actual loop at the end. You're gonna do this for all the beads. Um, in this 4mm chain I use about 12 or 13 beads depending how long um, each and every link that we create will be. But the total length of the chain will again be about 14 centimeters. So now we're gonna attach these links to each other. So with your flat nose pliers, hold the one that you're gonna open the eye up. With your round nose pliers, open that eye, then attach the next link and close it again with your round nose pliers and then you will continue this process until you've attached them all to each other and created a chain. And then it is time to attach the earring hook and the tiny lobster clasp. We're doing this with 4mm jump rings. Again, make these open with your flat nose pliers and round nose pliers. Bend them slightly, um, attach the chain and the binding to it and then close them up again and do the same for the other side and then you're done. So as you have seen, you only need basic jewelry supplies for these and you can go as crazy as you want. I showed you two main techniques that I use for mine. You can make double layers, triple layers, you can attach um, charms to it, you can use different beads. 
it's all up to you how you want to make it. I really like this simple beaded one. It's the one that um, I wear most. I also have some plain chain ones. So if you guys decide to recreate a nose to ear chain or lip to ear chain, please let me know because I would love to see how that turns out. Um, yeah, if you decide to buy one from my Etsy store, if you send in a picture, you will even get a discount on future orders. If you want me to do other DIY videos, you can of course leave suggestions in the comment section. I will be more than happy to have a look at them and if possible create the tutorials. Uh, maybe even subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I would love to have your ear for every single video I make and I will hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!